to focus. This is so annoying. Titus, help. Ugh. What else can I do to help me focus? What are my goals that I want to achieve in this lifetime? Maybe I can buy a dog, meet Elon Musk. I don't know, I can't even think right now. I know what I'm gonna do today. Try Emma Chamberlain coffee. Hey, what's up guys? So I made a little bit of a splurge purchase the other day. I've been seeing Chamberlain coffee everywhere on my Instagram page and I finally decided, you know what? I like her, we're gonna, we're gonna support her and we're going to get some of her coffee and try it out. The only thing is I was kind of worried about the taste. I'm like, oh, is it gonna taste good? Is it actually gonna be good if you have to like, like brew it individually? I don't know, I'm more of an espresso kind of gal. I figured I would test it out so that you could test it out too if it's good. Okay, bada bing, bada boom. Here we go. It came delivered in this nice box. And yes, I'm leaving the cat there. All right. Oh, it actually smells really good. Okay. So I got, it's basically just like a bunch of individual coffee things. But the one that I got is the special dog blend. Four out of five caffeine strength, medium roast, velvety sweet. Four, dunk and steep. So very simple criteria here. Basically just dunk the bag in hot water for 15 to 30 seconds or longer for more strength and then steep it for about five plus minutes. All right, so we're putting this baby in here. Sometimes I'm just impressed at myself with the fact that it literally is pour over coffee and I managed to mess it up. We're gonna leave this here and it's gonna go for five plus minutes, so I'll be back. I guess this will just sit here. I'm gonna make my breakfast. All right, you guys. So I prepped my meal. So I got my egg whites and egg, and I've got my toast. I've got sugar-free vanilla creamer for this coffee right here. So I like my coffee stronger. It makes me feel like it's doing more. So yes, it has definitely adopted a coffee color, obviously. Yeah, it's good. I hesitated because it's not as strong as I would normally want it, but I think it's just because I picked a medium roast. So that's why. But it is very sweet. Like it seems almost like, it's not fruity, but it seems very sweet and tasteful. Here, what's it supposed to taste like? Velvety sweet. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it makes sense, it makes sense. So it actually is nice. I actually wouldn't need creamer if I didn't want it. I just like the taste of creamer, but I really wouldn't need it. I don't know if you can put creamer in it with the bag. That probably defeats the whole purpose. We're gonna find out today. But I'm gonna leave the bag in there anyway. But yeah, no, it's actually good. It's actually, it, I mean, it's exactly what it says on the label. It says it's sweet and a medium roast, so it makes a lot of sense. It'll probably taste better once I actually have it how I normally have my coffee. Yeah, okay, yeah, so now it's a lot better. It just needed some creamer, to be honest with you. So yeah, I would recommend this. You can also buy the whole package and you can make a whole thing yourself. Like you can just put it in your coffee pot, which is convenient as well. I think it started out like this though. She's expanded her market to her audience, which I like. I definitely, I would buy it again. I would buy it again. Yeah, okay, okay, cool. So this is a win. I would rate it 10 out of 10. I think it was very good. That's not just because I like her but I think she did a great job with her coffee tastes and I'm excited for anyone to try it. So if you're thinking about trying Chamberlain coffee, I would recommend it. The price breaks down to about $2 a cup. So if you're going out and getting coffee all the time anyway, making lattes, whatever, you're saving money by, by getting it with her, her brand too. So cool. Well, I think this was successful. I hope you have a great day. If you want me to test any other products, let me know and I'll just, push that button and just buy more stuff that I don't need.
Gosh, I've been eyeing this toast this whole time. Mmm. Oops, I'm still recording. So I've just been sitting here doing some stuff on my computer and I just have to say that I definitely feel the caffeine from this. So I was worried about that, that it wouldn't be as strong because it was like a steeped baggie or something like that. No, nope, I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. I'm pretty sensitive to caffeine though, but I just wanna let you know that I feel everything jittery. So it works in case you're wondering. So anyway, give yourself a big hug. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Well, I have to go to the beach again. That's original. I can put my cats in a cat backpack. Oh, no.